On this webisode of Mythbusters, Cary Grant and Tori host their very own TNT party. <laughs> At a local quarry lake, they prove that this cutting edge viral commercial is a bust. The amount of dynamite used wouldn't create an explosion of that size, and it certainly wouldn't cause waves big enough to surf. Plus, they saw that unlike ocean swells pushed towards shore by weather, tides, and currents, waves created from an explosion radiate outwards and lose energy fairly quickly, which meant Robo Grant was left thinking about his next trip to Hawaii for some decent action. And to find out more details about the explosives and underwater explosions in the show, here's Professor Van Romero and retired FBI agent and honorary Mythbuster, Frank Doyle. If we're going to set up our explosive next to a wall underwater, is that going to create a bigger wave? What is really going to cause the wave is this big gas bubble. And the gas bubble will be deformed by a barrier. So my opinion is I don't think it'll help. Actually, you want the charge to be pretty close to the surface in a fairly open area. How big of an explosion are we going to need to make a surfable wave, something like three feet? It looks like at about 150 feet away from detonation, it'll take about 400 pounds of explosives near the surface to create a three-foot wave. Frank, it's always good to see you, because I know when I see you, things are going to explode. Well, that's good. We're always happy to please uh, everybody by blowing up something. What are we going to be using today? Well, we're going to use the uh, same thing that we have in the past, and that's an explosive called pentalite. And pentalite is just basically a melted-down, reformed TNT. So, Frank, in the clip, it looks like they're using three sticks of dynamite. How much explosive is that, and do you think it would create a, a wave big enough to surf? Well, typically, three sticks of dynamite would be equal to about three and three-quarter pounds. Uh, we're going to not even begin with that because that would only create a little ripple on the surface of the water. So you can't just get three sticks of dynamite, throw it in a channel, and get a surfable wave? Well, did a little calculation on that. Mm -hmm. If you take a stick of dynamite, weighs about a little over a pound, mm -hmm. and you threw it into a channel, mm -hmm. you'd get a wave about one inch high.